Greetings, people of the world. Thank you for joining us today on The Hive. My name is Joel. And I'm Florence. Today, we have a wonderful device for distributing a single HDMI signal to multiple TVs in remote locations. The ANU Video ANI 0104 PoE can split an HDMI signal to five separate signals. One locally using an HDMI cable and four longer distances up to 150 feet using CAT 5E or 6 cables. Now before we install this bad boy, let's open up the box and see what's included inside. So we've got our main unit, the ANI 0104 PoE. As you can tell, it's very thin and this can easily sit on top of your HD source that you'll be using. These are the receivers that will go to each display. You can also see that it has mounting ears. It's very compact and thin, and it can easily hide behind your TV. These are our IR receivers, and this is the transmitter. This transmitter connects to the main unit, while these four IR receivers will connect directly to the receiver. We've got our universal power supply for all regions, and also optional surface mounting brackets for the main unit. And lastly, we've got our instruction manual. Today, we'll be utilizing four 150-foot Category 6 cables, which will connect to the CAT outputs located on the left side of the splitter. Of course, we're going to have to connect the other end of the Category cables to the four receivers. Now, on the other end, we're going to grab the four HDMI cables from each of our display and connect them to the HDMI output of the receiver. Now back to the splitter, we have our HDMI output. This output will connect directly to our local HDTV. The HDMI input is for our HD source. Today we'll be using a Comcast cable box. This port is our IR out. If you'll be using the IR remote, connect the IR blaster in direct line of sight of the equipment you want to be controlling. The EDIT selector allows you to select the output signal format. Next to the EDIT selector is a mini USB port for firmware updates. The last port we have is our DC 12 volt power supply. And all the way to the right is our power on and off switch. Okay, so we just completed the install of the splitter. All we need to do is power her on, which I'll do right now. It's gonna take a few seconds to process. Once we see the image, you'll see that it's actually a full HD 1080p signal at 60 Hertz. Now the display to my right is our local HDMI loop out. It's a shorter cable run, which is this cable right here. This is about a 15 or 20 feet HDMI cable. The displays to my left are receiving the signal from category cable. Each of these displays have a receiver and the receiver is necessary to convert the signal from the category cable back to HDMI. And as you can see, this receiver is very compact, it's sleek, and you can actually mount it behind your TV for a nice, clean install. You'll also notice that this receiver does not have separate power. That's because the splitter has power over Ethernet, and it's receiving the power from this device through the category cable. Which is the ANI 0104 PoE is ideal for situations where you need to send an HDMI signal to remote locations. For example, if you're a sports bar owner and you've got TVs located adjacent to the bar, this is very ideal. Also, if you're a homeowner and you have displays or TVs maybe in your kitchen or your patio, and you need to send an HDMI signal a long distance, this will work for that situation. Say you've got up to eight TVs, a new video also has a one by eight version. And you can actually search for that on bzbexpress.com or just check our description links below. We included the links for the one by four and the one by eight version. Thanks again for joining us for today's episode. Please show us some love and hit the like button. And also, don't forget to subscribe to BZB TV, where we show you how to amplify your world. Until next time, my name is Florence. I'll catch you in the next episode of The Hive.